Hey guys, this is Nettie with Rocket Powered Sound. In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to make the sustain bass from Crank That STFU, which sounds something like this. Crank That put this one out not too long ago, and it goes absolutely crazy in my opinion, so I'm pretty excited to get into this. This preset is going to be free to download for you guys in the description, so be sure to check that out. And if you guys want to get more presets like this, then also be sure to check out the Tarot Toolkit or the Riot for Serum presets from Rocket Powered Sound. They've got lots of presets like just like this one. But anyway, let's get right into this. All right, so here we are in Serum. Let's get to making this STFU uh, sustain base. So we've got the init preset. So the first thing we're gonna do is go get a sine wave. So you're gonna, we're gonna go click on the wavetable thingy, go to uh, analog and basic shapes. And we've got the, the, the sine wave already loaded up, so we don't gotta touch that. Um, we're gonna go to the random knob. We're gonna turn that all the way down. Um, and that's gonna mean that it starts at the same exact place every time on like this you know, rotation instead of kind of like choosing a random spot, which is what we want. Then we're going to turn on oscillator B and turn the level all the way down like that. Then we're going to go to the wavetable again and we're going to go to digital and we're going to go to harmonic series and we're going to get a wavetable that looks like this. Then we're going to turn the random down as well on that. Um, and so currently that's uh, going to sound just like just like that. It's just a sine wave right now. But here's where the magic happened. So a harmonic series wavetable looks like this. It does some like funky stuff like, you know, like when turn it up it basically just adds like repeats of like sine waves so it just like it's just like i don't know it's cool cool stuff so what we're gonna do is we're gonna fm um the oscillator a from oscillator b so fm from b and we're gonna put that to maybe like here ish like 30 something percent that's so gonna sound like this right now turn that up a bit now uh this this doesn't this sounds nothing like the bass right okay so let's fix that First thing we're gonna do is we're gonna take this up one octave. Now we got kind of like a bit, bit of a bass going on already. And now what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this wet position on the oscillator B and we're gonna turn this up to 15 exactly. And now we're gonna get like a, like a really loud, obnoxious, um, like screechy thing. So we're getting there. Um, and now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to the effects and this is where it's really gonna come alive, of course. Um, so, um, first thing we're going to do is we're going to take this alpha one and we're going to make kind of like this kind of shape. And so let's put this also on uh, envelope mode. And now what we're going to do is we're going to take the distortion, just keep it on tube mode and just turn that all the way up. And there we go. We've got like pretty much, uh, maybe put that out where we've got that on 42%. That's, that's good. It's, it's kind of loud, of course. Um, now what we're going to do is we're going to get a filter. I'll put that before the distortion and then uh, take the LFO one and put that on the cutoff and then we're just going to mess with the cutoff position by the way a little trick if you guys didn't know if you press alt and shift and you press like you know these little knobs you can like switch between like this mode and this mode one little trick or you can also go to uh matrix and then click this thing right here type and that'll switch between like unipolar and bipolar mode uh anyway um yeah we're gonna just kind of like <laughs> Put that like somewhere, something like that. There you go, and then we're gonna just compress it. And there you go. That's that's the uh, that's the SDFU sustain base. You know. So yeah, I hope you guys found this educational. Uh, be sure to check out the download link with the link in the description. It's completely free. And yeah, I hope to see you guys in another video. Bye bye.